Our core business as a university, and I mean the College of Engineering, is to train students and in order to train students, and I mean top-notch students, we also need good professionals and good human resource. And in that wise, we are very much concerned, and myself as the provost, very much concerned about getting top-level professors to help in teaching. So we first take the training of our professors very seriously. The way is severe enough to deteriorate and cause a downfall in the performance of the device. And we are doing it using a software called... We also want to concentrate, especially on the students. And as we concentrate on the students, we are looking at what the teaching and the teachers will bring us. And we are also looking at what we can help in terms of laboratory equipment. Our labs are fully equipped. We have petroleum laboratories. We have autotronic, we have mechatronics. We have chemical engineering laboratories. And we have laboratories for all the 15 disciplines of engineering that we undertake. At my young age, I started developing the passion for electronics. That passion I had, I'm still uh, working on that passion to develop that passion up to today. And then that is the reason why I'm in College of Engineering, KMC, to fulfill my dream, to work on my passion, and then see how I can help my community grow better. When I got to KMC, we have opportunity to have access to all the labs around the faculty. We want to make sure that in addition to the presence of laboratory equipment, we also give them support in terms of software training. Because in engineering, once they get out of school and they get into the field, we want to make sure that they, they have the expertise in the use of most of the current softwares which they need in their training. Some of the projects that our students have worked on, for instance, in one of the courses that I taught, I gave them the challenge of going out there to identify a problem and then come up with a solution. Some went out there and came back with the problem of how to uh, develop an intelligent basket. An intelligent basket solved the problems of long queues as far as the shopping mall is concerned. So that as people are shopping and they are dropping their things in the basket, automatically the basket is able to calculate how much they are supposed to pay and then at the desk they give out their money and they are gone. And they are, that is able to shorten the time as far as uh, marketing is concerned. Everyone is actually looking for a job, not to create a job. But College of Engineering is actually giving me the opportunity to create a job. I mean, before finishing my education here, I have my company already that I'm really employing people and we are working together and then we are creating more jobs for other people to join. We are not waiting for the in quotes, the governments or someone to create a job for us. Going through the four-year experience of computer engineering here it equipped me with some skills that made me productive after school. And after school, I've been able to start a business on my own. I work as a computer programmer. And I'm also furthering here in KNUST, my master's. I'm doing them for computer engineering. I now don't have to wait for someone to employ me, but on my own, I can do things. I develop software, um, mobile apps, websites, web applications, and things like that on my own. We are also very mindful of the soft skills that the students must have. And with this, we are looking at entrepreneurial training. And we have programs and individual standalone subjects which train them in entrepreneurship and innovation. And in this line, we have students who have gone on to do a lot of practical things. And one such innovation is a student and a group of students who are able to do 3D printers. And we also have students who have been able to manufacture an integrated circuit, that's an IC, which was done in collaboration with Texas Instruments in the US. We can also buy 3D printers from outside, but they are really expensive. What can you do from what you are learning from school? 
What you can do is to make the theory we are learning from school to practical. Then the practical is what you are now doing in labs at the College of Engineering. I used to sell 3D printers online, advertising, but just mouth to mouth. When people contact me, I just have a page on Facebook. The school did very well in helping me broaden my scope and give me a lot of options. We want to train complete students. And if I talk about complete students, we want to train students who are good in theory, who understand theory. We want to train students who are good in practical. We want to train students who are innovative. And we also want to train students who are good in research. So we are taking them through basic research methods. We are taking them through startups and how they can dominate in their various industries by virtue of an understanding of the things that they do and the things that they've been taking through.